Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Sky Factory 4. It's Dix here and today guys we're gonna do a bunch more achievements, hopefully. So there is a bunch of stuff still in here. These are all complete, I believe. Oh, Age of Enchantment. We have not finished this one. Okay. Um, we can craft a few of these things. Okay, very cool. So we can do a few of these. Uh, obviously there's heaps in here that we need to start getting set up. Prestige is done and Age of Exploration is not done. So actually, now that I've seen those things, let's um let's stand in here in our nice nice area here, and let's have a look through here. Wait, there is uh, age this one here. Uh, inflict twenty or more damage to a creature. Okay, so that might we'll have to create a really cool uh, weapon for that. Craft a lumber axe in the tool forge to cut down entire trees, and craft a yo-yo. Okay, so we can do that. I do want to get a yo-yo, guys. You can use it as a weapon. It's pretty cool. Uh, craft a weirding gadget to chunk load a five times five area. Okay, so we'll we let's just type in weird for now. Weird. There we go. See if we can make this. Uh, we can. Okay, so that's one of the challenges done. This I guess just loads the chunk, but we don't need any of these chunks load because we're all we're. I'd say we're in the in the spawn chunks. But um, maybe we should make things like this not in the spawn chunks and then load it because that thing's laggy. But if we built it somewhere else. We wouldn't be loading the animations, but it would still be doing its its thing. So, yeah, maybe we should have built something like that. It's turned off for the episode, guys. Um, I can have it on when I'm um when I'm just hanging around, but um yeah, it hasn't even made its way here yet. We've only got eight of these. We need nine to make one of these. So yeah, it's going to take us a very long time <laughs> to get down to here to the octuple. But um yeah, I'm just get when I'm not recording, I'll probably turn that on. I can handle the FPS. Like I just don't want it on the video. Um, anyway, so that's that's one more. Uh, craft need an inventory upgrade. Okay, we can we can do that. What happened to my thing? Um, inventory upgrade. Inventory upgrade looks like this one. Okay, what are we missing? Missing a cake. Can we make a cake? Okay, we need three buckets of milk. Okay, we can do that. We need to make an ender chest. We can do that. Okay, let's get some buckets. As per usual, we don't have milk that is always the problem okay we're gonna have to craft a couple of buckets here um yeah so over to the cows as per usual always with the milk that we're lacking for cakes and um, we should probably make a few cakes to be honest because we're going to need um we're gonna need cakes to build there's there's a few other types of cakes we need to build and we probably um yeah we probably need a few more all right we can get this now there we go Okay, I've crafted it, but it does say craft and eat. So craft and eat. Okay, so once we eat this, okay, whoa. Um, didn't seem to work though. I don't, I don't really know what that does. It makes a very weird noise, but it doesn't seem to work. I thought I'd get a four times, uh, a three times three crafting table in my normal inventory, but apparently not, guys. Maybe you have to click somewhere else to get it. I, I don't, I don't really know. Um, it doesn't matter anyway because we've got this, so we just craft everything on the go anyway but that's another one of those done uh the glitch infused armor set now that is a bit difficult we might get into that later craft an unbreakable t tinkers construct tool i'm gonna have to look into that because i don't know how to do that but we can craft a lumber axe i'm sure let's just quickly do that guys and we'll get onto some more exciting stuff and then we can go in here we can put these in here and there we go and we got the challenge okay fantastic and create a yo-yo. We're gonna do that in a different episode, and I don't know what to do with this, to be honest. Uh, I mean, maybe we just need to fight a big, a big mob. Anyway, let's have a look in some of these other ones, guys. I think uh, we should we can go to the Nether, place a uh, water, and and put a boat on it. That's that's very simple. We can do that. Let's let's do that now. Well, that didn't turn out very well, but we got out. Luckily, we can fly, otherwise we would have uh, been in some serious trouble there. Okay, well, the boat's gone. Um, see, see you later, boat. Um, let, let's head back home. I don't like this place. Not at all. So we must defeat the Wither. So we're in our Roman temple, and we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna utilize it to fight this beast in this Witherproof cage. So I've done reinforced obsidian, and then we've got some reinforced glass here as well. So let's go. Let's uh let's put this on here and then what the heck he looked very interesting then. 
Actually, hopefully he doesn't blow anything else up. I, I don't think he can blow anything else up. Valkyrie of the Night. Uh, yeah, he, he, he blew some holes in, in my thing here. That's very disappointing. Hopefully he can't get out of there, though. Um, it seems very... Holy heck. He's getting very angry. I don't think he can see me, but, you know, he is he is very angry. So we need to we need to get him over here. He's he's way in the corner. Come this way, my friend. Not in the corner. Okay, he thinks he can make it out of that corner, so I'm gonna have to block that up. So he can't do this. Well this is this has been a complete fail so far, guys, so let's get a bunch more of this. So run out of this again. He is just breaking things everywhere. Oh dear, what is he doing? We don't want to make too much of this stuff. Right, let's, um... Oh, where have I put it? I'm clicking too many buttons too fast. Okay. It's very loud, guys. Sorry. Alright, guys. We should be able to whack him through here. It might take us a while to kill him. Oh, now he's just moved away. Can we... Is he gonna get out if we walk in here? Can he fit out a two, two space gap? No, he can't. Okay, fantastic. Let's take this guy down. Oh, this is going to take forever. Because he is not just the normal wither. Well, I guess we're supposed to be shooting him with, like, bow and arrow right now. But we've got him down. He's not healing. He's, he's not shooting us. We're not dying. So it's okay. Which, however long it takes. We'll just wait for the sword to charge back up properly every time. We should be doing a lot more damage, hopefully. Okay, now he's on the ground. He should take a lot more damage now anyway. Wow, this thing takes forever. It's not doing over 80 damage though, is it? Not uh, 20 damage for that achievement. So anyway, the wither is down. Now we can bust this out. That hurt. Okay, he's almost down. Uh, two more hits. One more hit, and he is gone. Okay. Well, that that worked out very badly. But um, yeah, we broke a few things. I'm a little bit injured, but I have a lot of food and things like that. So there we go. All back up. We're fine. Um, well, that was that was exciting. Now I've got to fix this. Stupid wither idiot. I guess he can break blocks out the corner. So if you don't want him to do that, you probably have to make this thing uh, a bit bigger. Yeah, a bit bigger for sure. Um, this could you really use vein miner right about now. And just before anyone says anything, guys, we already had the wither skeleton heads from earlier on. We had to uh, create some to get the wither skeleton mob thing without actually going to the end or something. I don't know, but we crafted them and we put them in this little chamber and killed them. That's how we had the wither skeleton skulls. I have crafted a new cake, guys. The end cake. So let's head to the end. Apparently there's no dragon here, guys. So, but there is a few things we need to do in here in order to get the achievements. So let's pop through and see what they are. And there you go, guys. We end up here. It gives you this cake, by the way. Also, don't tell me I'm cheating. Let's put this here. We are at the coordinates 101. Okay, we should be we should be fine. Let's get out of here. There's no dragon here, I, I presume, because it's called Where's the Boss Gone? And it says that there's no, there's no boss. So I'm hoping that is correct. Now, the problem is we're going to look at Enderman for sure. But I think if we just remember those coordinates, don't look at these freaks. Obviously, stuff can spawn everywhere here. There's a bat. Definitely a bat. Okay, let's let's not look at any of these guys. Um, how do we get to the other cities and stuff? That's that's what I want to know. I guess we just we have to fly out to them instead of uh, instead of doing that. Okay, we hopefully we have enough uh, flying time. I'm just gonna fly in one direction, guys, and see what happens. Hopefully, we find some. I mean, I found a black hole. Hopefully, we. Oh, I've got no idea where I am now. Okay, there's that. Let's head this way. Let's keep the coordinates up and just make sure we head in one direction. That'll that'll be good. Right, we're heading south. Let's just keep going south until we find some floating end islands. Alrighty, guys, we've found an island. I'll just pop up a few of these chorus fruit things. Break this down here. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so we got some more chorus fruit because I'm going to need some liquid chorus. And I, I presume we just cook this stuff up. But I'm not entirely sure, so... Yeah, I, I think we just cook it up and try and put it in a bucket. There's no actual recipe for it, so we're just going to have to guess. I'm going to turn F7 off because they're just making this look ridiculous. Um, I have got a thing at home back at the base that is making chorus fruit. It's just very, very slow. Uh, we need to find an end city now, so we're going we're gonna to fly around here a bit until we find one. And hopefully we need to get the elytra. So if we just click on here, we need to get 
uh, Dragon's Breath, which is uh, what I was just talking about, and travel deep into the end city to find an Elytra. So that is what we're going to do. That should be hopefully pretty easy. And if we look at Dragon's Breath up here, guys, this is the crafting recipe. Uh, so we can get all of this except for this. I don't, I, I don't know how to get this. So maybe we find that in things or maybe we cook it up and put it in the bucket. So I don't know. We'll see what happens What happens if you put chorus fruit in the smeltery. We'll, we'll just have to find out. Oh, what is this stuff, though? This could be handy. Um, is this for resonant in stone? Okay, so we're losing all the items, basically, because they're all teleporting everywhere. But what is this stuff? Resonant something around oh, we're gonna teleport everywhere if we're not careful i forgot about this stuff it's crazy stuff we need yeah there's there's just stuff going everywhere but hopefully we should be able to collect a bit of this okay guys i went home and grabbed a stack of ender pearls because i tried to kill a few of these guys wasted my time i've uh, put my flying time up to over an hour now so we should be safe we're gonna come out here now and i um yeah i i couldn't find anything while i was out here before i was uh I found these islands, but I was going around for ages. I didn't know there was one of those teleporter things until I flew past it, and then there was one in the main area. I don't know if it was there before we left or just because I flew past it. But basically, guys, oh, we should... Let's go back. I'm, I'm mucking everything up. We need to put a marker on the map here so that we can find our way back to this thing because it'll be much quicker to come here than it will be to go anywhere else. And now I appear to... No. Okay, here it is. Let's put a marker on the map right here. We've got a map. Why don't we use the thing? I'm just not used to having it. So what I'm going to do is look straight down so I don't look at any of those freaks. How do I get the map open, guys? Nobody knows. I've forgotten. Is it P? It's not P. That's what that is. Oh, no. Now I've got to go into my controls and find out what it is. Okay, guys. We'll be able to find that now wherever we go. Let's try and find... One of these end cities. I was flying around for a while before and I couldn't find one. So I hope that they are generating correctly because it is a mod pack. So maybe they're not. And just as I say that, I find one. But I think this isn't one with a ship. So we're not going to be able to complete the challenge. And it... Oh, there are shulkers here. But they get wrecked. And, I mean, I can fly. So I can do what I want, man. I don't have to abide by your rules. Okay, cool. So, um, that's interesting. It's very hard as long as I don't put myself on anything. There's a shulker shell. Brilliant. Okay, so there's nothing of any interest in here by the looks of it, guys. Not too sure. There's just a few of these freaks. Oh, make sure we hit those. Anyways, um, I'll be right back. Hopefully I found one of these. Finally, guys, we found one with a ship. This is the third one that we've gone to, so we can jump in here and get our elytra. That is what I am happy about, guys. Oh, we got some instant health potions as well. Why not? Why not take them? Let's take this guy down. These guys take quite a while to kill. But that should be gone. Okay, there we go. Right, let's see what's in here. We got a diamond sword. We got a heart container, which is brilliant. Corrupted chorus root. Don't know what they are. What else do we got? Some boots, some diamonds. All of this stuff would normally be really good. But there we go. Got wings. Let's check in here. We just need to craft dragon's breath. Hmm. I, do, I don't know how to do that, guys. I really don't. Um, let's go get the dragon head off the front of the boat, and then we should be pretty much pretty much done with the end here. Oh, God, this is going to take a while. Come on, Mr. Dragon Head. Don't fall off, don't fall off. Pop in the right direction. Oh, this really is slow. And we got it. Okay, very cool. Alrighty, guys. Well, uh, we don't need much else from the end, so I'm just going to check if there's any cool chests in here. And I'll see you back at home. That's uh, one more thing. Let's see if we can get these chorus fruit things. Um, let's see if we can get the chorus stuff smelted so that we can uh, so we can get. Oh, there's a saddle. Get one of them. Um, yep, I'm I'm getting out of here before we get beaten up. Okay, guys, we have discovered how to make the chorus buckets. So you need this. You need two of these to make the dragon's breath. So in order to get this, you need liquid chorus. So what you guys got to do is make the mechanical squeezer here. Put in eight popped chorus fruit into here. It'll uh, instantly get sucked out because I put a fluid thing onto here into this bucket. And then you just click on it with a normal bucket and then you've got it like we have here. So we can craft this now. Very good. There we go. Uh, so that's, that's pretty cool. That's all done. Um, what do we need from here? What else is there to do? That is all done. We need to craft a floaty McFloaty block, which I mean that sounds great. We can we can we can craft one of those probably. 
let's just type in floaty. There we go, there it is. That shouldn't be too difficult. Okay, how do we make feathers? Like that. Uh, twilight, statues, or the market. Okay, we'll get some seeds. We'll, we'll, we'll get some seeds and some feathers. We got normal seeds here. And we'll go to Matt Damon over here. Let's have a look, my friend. He should have feathers. And we can get that for... We can get just... Let's just get, I don't know, this many. There we go. That's all done. Put those in the system. Now I've forgotten what we were making, guys. What were we making? We're making a floaty McFloaty block. There we go. Brilliant. Done. That challenge is done. So, guys, basically this block is for starting new islands. So you can just place it anywhere in the air. There you go, like that. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Can, can we pick it back up again? Yes, we can. Very good. Okay, so if we want to start a new island somewhere, we don't have to build a big path out there. We can just take this with us and start there, which we will do. I think I'm going to move some of these extreme farms over there and then have them transport back here somehow. I'm not sure how. Um, okay, guys, so we are rattling on through these. Obviously, there's a couple more here to do around. Travel to the hunting dimension using a hunting, hunting dimension cake. Obviously, that's probably pretty easy to make. And craft a Vscraft airship. Guys. Guys. Guys, we want an airship. I want to fly around in an airship. How do we how do we do that? Oh, oh, okay. Um This all looks very, very difficult. Um Uh let, let's have a look into this actually. Let's have a look into it. What can we Oh yeah, okay, never mind. These are all built out of easy things. It looks like we can build most of this stuff. What's this? So we can make a minecart. That's obviously very easy. And what are these things here? Logic chip. Okay, well, obviously, we can just make a bunch of them. We might need them, so I'll just make 16 for now. So we can make the airship frame now. We have most of the stuff by the looks of it. Okay, we don't have leather. Airship core. Okay, I, I can't remember how to get magma blocks, but we will. Okay, hang on. I'm sure we can get it. There we go. Oh, there's no more slime. Where's the slime? There's there's so much slime in here, it's not even funny. So, I mean, we can just put any slime with this, right? Yeah, there we go. Let's get eight. Make two of these at least. There we go. Back to the airship. Oh my guys, God, God, guys. I'm super excited for an airship. Let me craft all this mess up and I'll see if we can get this going. Okay, guys, I'm excited. We have an airship. It It's raining, unfortunately, but let's see what happens. Let's, uh... If we take this out, I think we need to place some torches here, 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 and here. Okay, let's place our airship up here. I mean, I guess you just, just place it on a block. What, what, do you, what do you do with this thing? Oh, okay, we're going to have to do some reading, guys. Hold shift and right click to throw an item and unleash the airship within. Oh, hold shift and click. Oh, what? where did it go? Oh, guys, guys, look at it. It's a little airship. Oh my g <laughs> Oh this is amazing. How okay, I'm in. Uh how do we how do we drive? Okay, I can Okay, it's it's looking this way. That's why. That's the front there. Um how do we go up and down? How how do we how how do we go up and down? That's the real question, guys. Uh can we pick it back up? Yes we can. Okay, so maybe if we shift over this to throw item and unleash the airship. Uh stored redstone. Okay, we have to put redstone in it. Or a redstone charge, maybe. Maybe it means like redstone flux. Uh, let's click that. That should make it go there. It's going to float down slowly. What an awesome little ship. Holy heck. There's a few different ones of these as well. This this is not the best one. I'm guessing this is the best one. Because, uh, I mean, it doesn't even tell me how to make it, to be honest. I can't even craft the others. So, who knows? Um, let's let's see. Let's get some redstone out of the system and see if we can put that in. Just redstone dust. Redstone dust. Let's grab a bunch of that. Okay, now can we click on it with this? Can we shift click this in? No. Okay, maybe we need to do it in your inventory. So let's pick this up. Um, we're just placing redstone everywhere, guys. That's what we're doing. Okay, let's put this in here and put this up here. No, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. Stored redstone, it says. Hold shift for more info. Hmm. I I don't I don't know, guys. I don't know. Maybe we need to char charge it somehow. Um, let's go up to something over here that can charge things. It doesn't have one of those like 
electric bars on it that things normally have. You know what I mean? I don't know what I mean. But normally if you have like a battery or something, you can just put these in and it charges them. And anything wireless should get charged by that. So, hmm, I really am not too sure to be honest, guys. I'm going to have to do some research, but this thing is awesome. Okay, guys, there is a shortcut to open the GUI, which is uh, number pad 8 for me. So it looks like you can store insert fuel. No, okay, so redstone doesn't work. You can insert coal. That works. Okay, cool. So we can fly now. Oh, yeah, guys. Oh, yeah, look at this thing. So cool. We can just We can just fly around now. I mean, it looks like we got 15 minutes, but we can't fly very high. This is as high as we can get. So I guess it is high as high above the the, neck, the block. So in here, we'll be able to go higher because there's a block. Okay, maybe we can't go past 75. Oh, yeah, we can't go past 75 high. But this thing is still pretty damn awesome, guys. Look at us. We, we, are, we are snazzy. We are very snazzy. Let's, let's get a screenshot of that. That's pretty cool. Just chilling in our little in our little buggy. Um, I'm gonna fly out of here now. Let's uh, let's get back around to the front so I know what I'm doing. And yeah, we can stay up here. And okay, well this this is useless but amazing. I mean, pretty pretty amazing, guys. Pretty amazing. I like it. Very cool. So guys, the airship is pretty awesome, and also it looks like there's a bunch of upgrades as well. You can put bombing on this thing and all sorts of stuff. This could be really cool in a different mod pack, but obviously we've got everything we need here. But I, I mean, I might do a few upgrades. Let's just see what they cost. Let's open it in here so we can do this. Let's, uh, so you can put music in. I mean, that's pretty special. You can put storage, you can put uh, more fuel efficiency. Let's go for greater speed for now. So we need a module chip. So we need two of those, and we need, I think we should have mostly everything else, to be honest. Uh, what is it, What is one of these? Okay, so you've got to make these in the first place. you got to make the lesser speed one, then you got to make this one. Okay, so we, we need to make quite a few of these. Let's make another four of those. That should get us this module anyway. Oh dear, what are we missing now? Uh, okay, no, we already got one of those. What are we missing? Should have all of this stuff. Yes, I thought I just did that anyway. Um, and this one we should have as well. So there we go. Now if we hop in our little machine here, should be able to press number pad 8, go to upgrade, and then go in frame FX airships base speed. Yes. Why can't we put this in? Main menu. Oh, I've dropped it. Go, go and pick it up. Go and pick it up. Okay, very good. Um, let's open that again. Maybe I have to put it in here. Um, I don't know how I can't put it in the upgrade slot. Do I have to put it down here, maybe? Oh, now I've really done it. I've got to go pick it up again. This is this is a strange mod, guys, I tell you. Um, can we put it in here? Put it in here? Um, it, it doesn't appear that we can put it in anywhere. Redstone available. Redstone balance. It, what does that do, guys? I don't know. I don't know how to upgrade this thing now. Maybe if we get the lesser speed module first. Oh my goodness. Let's see if we can get the lesser speed. Let's craft another one of these and see if this works. And just see if we can put this in first because it doesn't have everything it needs. Uh, okay, let's craft a few more of those. Um, I just made them. They're right here. Why won't you go in? Silly thing. Okay, now we can press 8, and now let's go to upgrade and see if we can put this in. Nope. Apparently, we cannot upgrade this thing. Can we put it in here? Oh. Learn. Okay, we can earn that. That's going to cost 15. That's going to cost 15, but we can't... I don't understand this. So if we do this, it's going to slow us down. Is that right? Okay, if we put this in, it's not going to work. Can I take this out? costs nothing I don't okay we need to do each upgrade for some some reason I'll be right back okay guys I've figured this out a little bit you need to uh, in order to upgrade the frame you got to put these in and these are just modules where you can make the speed go faster so I've put the modules in. you need to put level one two and then three in 
you can't just put them in and then the upgrades are the same you got to put one two and three in you put them in here and then you pr this will go green and you press green and it pushes it up into there so that's how you install those and then once you put some fuel in here like this you'll be able to fly it around and as you can see i can go a lot faster now i can't turn very fast but i can go a lot faster i was much slower than this before so if we press f5 as you can see we are much much faster now so that's pretty cool and yeah right that's it guys that that is our little airship i like it i like it a lot um but the, the turning is terrible and i can't see any upgrades for turning to be honest but you know i'm just gonna park this guy up here and uh yeah i'll i'll uh, see you later mr airship H have fun over there okay guys there is just a few more on this page to do so we might as well complete it today i'm gonna make another cake here because i presume we need it for the hunting cake so let's type in hunting dimension there we go there's the cake and we will need a cake there we go cool very good we'll need to make uh four of these one two three four by the looks of it we should have arrows in here and there we go that should be that we actually have to go to the dimension though so i'm gonna put this up here with the rest of our cakes whoa that's an interesting looking cake um and we also need to travel to any size compact machines dimension now we're gonna get on with that in a different episode um i i i am not sure what a compact machine is but i, I this is just my guess it's another little world, but it's quite, it's it's very small, but it's maybe as big as this temple, like um, like floor space wise, and you can build a whole machine in it. And then when you come back here, it only takes up one block and that machine will do what it does in that. Uh, um, yeah, it'll, it'll do what everything that's in there in a one block space. So we might be able to put our power generation in there and maybe this monstrosity in there because uh, yeah, we're going to, some of the stuff lags, and I think that might be a way to do it as well, which would be really cool. Anyway, how do we get compact machines? That's what I want to uh, see. If we look on here, we should read this first. Uh, create a dimension using the miniaturization field projector. Use the personal shrinking device to enter the dimension. Okay, so we need a miniaturization field projector. Okay, Min let's just type in mini. We should be able to find it from there. Field projector, there we go. Okay, so that stuff's easy. Personal shrinking device. Let's make one of those for us and one of them for there and then one of these. And um, now we've got four. Okay, we've got this. My guess would be that we need to move this. Um, let's move this over to here. And if we hop out, hopefully that turns itself off and doesn't waste. It probably just wastes that last piece of coal and then turns off. I don't know, but um, wow, this is interesting. So it's got the arrows facing this way. So maybe we do this and face them all towards the center here. That is my guess. And then take out this. And let's just put a few torches back here, 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 and here, just so we don't get spawns. And missing opposite field projector. It is required to determine the field size. Okay, we're going to have to do some sort of investigation. And it took my thing, didn't it? It took my personalized shrinking device. There we go. Okay, compact machines, tunnels, redstone tunnels, miniaturization, crafting. Compact th Machines 3 allows you to build complex machine contraptions within a single block. I'm a genius, guys. I figured it out. Uh, available chapters. Okay. Compact machines are the core mechanic of this mod. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, I'm going to read through this, guys. And um, yeah, I will hopefully figure this out. Okay guys, it looks like you have to set these out quite a bit. So right now we have it scanning this area. As soon as you put them out, I've got a middle block here and then one, two, three space. And then on like on any block here. So there are a few different crafting recipes. You can look them up, do that, put redstone on top. And then I think you click this compact machine wall recipe four. Yeah. And then how do I, do I click it with this? I don't know how I make it actually craft it. Do I have to put redstone around it? I, I just watched a video and it was a bit confusing. So let's just try that okay no no valid recipe found so this is the correct recipe oh it's done it it's doing it it's doing it it's made it very tiny there we go we should get 16 of those okay i'm gonna do that a few times i don't really know how i made it do that how, how did i make it actually go did i is it because i stepped in there or go my friend does it just it, i i don't know how i made it do that i've got no idea very interesting maybe it seemed to do it after i removed that so no recipe found 
then now it's going. You know what, guys? I have no idea. I have, I have no idea. I, do, I don't know how I actually made it go. Okay, guys, I figured it out. You've got to throw a piece of redstone into the field. There we go. So it takes two redstone to make this thing. Okay, so I'm going to make just 64 of these, and then we can use these to craft the other stuff. So this is it, and then you just go Q into there. Okay, fantastic. That's that's brilliant, guys. Now let's look up the other recipe. So if we want to make a tiny compact machine, we have to put 26 of those in the square. Uh, if we want to make one of these, I guess we put 26 in, but we throw in a gold block. Um, oh no, we put an iron block in the middle. I'm guessing it's in the bot in the in the middle. So this one's a diamond. Uh, this one's that, and oh, this one's bigger. And throw this into the field to start the process. Okay, so we need some ender pearls for that. So that's pretty cool. Let's pick those up while we're at it. Make one more of these and throw that in. Now let's get some ender pearls. Ender pearls, ender pearls. That's what we want. Let's grab some of those. And we need gold block. So let's grab some, grab some gold as well. Uh, let's just make the gold one for now and see what happens. So I think if we go like this. This is just my guess, guys, because it doesn't really tell you where to put the gold block. So I'm going to put it right there and then do this. And then build this up like so. Okay, this is taking up all that space. Does that tell you what it is? Normal compact machine. Yes. Okay, cool. Now we need to throw one of these in. So we just Q into the space. There we go. Okay, this is going to make us a little machine, which is just really good. I don't know how to use the machine, but I think we need to make tunnels or something. So let's go at compact again. I think we need to make... Oh, that is not the at sign, but uh, we've found it anyway, so that's all right. Nope, I think we're missing something. At compact. Guys, why is the at sign not working? Can you not put it in here? Maybe you can't put it in here. Um, what? Oh, okay. you know what, guys? I don't know what's going on. So this is a tunnel. This is a redstone tunnel. Okay, so for turning things on and off. So we put one of those on the bottom, a hopper on top, and eight redstone around, and then you throw redstone in. Okay, let's let's make one of those. We got the machine. Um, got some of this, and then we're gonna need to put redstone around it, like so. And we need to put a hopper up there. So let's get a hopper. Um, this will make two, so I presume this is enough. And I'm gonna make a redstone one just in case as well. So place that on top. Cue in a piece of redstone there we go and now there should be one more that we need to make the redstone one um compact compact need to learn to spell that would really help everyone out a redstone block with redstone and you throw a redstone in okay very simple very simple indeed uh, let's just get the redstone and here we go guys this is the last piece we need i think to complete this challenge so let's do that let's place one of these down this is all, this is quite cool guys, I like this mod, so far anyway. Uh, I think it's going to be pretty useful to be able to make these little machines. Now, do they need power? That's the real question. I'm guessing they probably do. Although this, none of this has needed power so far. Okay, we've got all the tunnels and everything. Um, let me do a little bit more research so I don't blow myself up or break anything. Um, let's just go over here for now and uh, place it down and then we'll uh, we'll see what happens. All right, guys, just to test this out, we're going to place this down and then, uh, oh, we can't get in there, can we? We need the personal shrinking device. No, nope, we just need to click on it. And now we're loading into our little machine. That is fantastic. Okay, um, I wonder how big this is. I think it's going to be a five by five. And there we go, guys. Okay, we got an overworld cake. That's fantastic. So we can get back if we have to. I feel like we should just press shift and... Um, let's make ourselves spawn over here. So you hold shift and then you go entry point set. So this is where we're going to spawn now. Uh, let's put the cake right here so we can get back out. And okay, so we can place redstone tunnels on any wall we want. So that's a redstone one and a normal tunnel is on this side. Okay, very interesting. So we could make a whole machine in here. We could make the whole lava generation and power generation in this machine and then take it out through one of these ports. Okay, pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot, guys. Well, guys, I guess there's not much else to do but go to the hunting dimension. Let's check this place out. 
Well, that was fun. There's literally nothing here. I don't know if this is incorrect or what. We're gonna F3 and A and reload everything. No, there is literally nothing here. Um, I, I, you know, I don't get it. I don't get it at all. Is it meant to be something? Nope, there appears to be absolutely nothing. Okay, okay, let's just, let's go home. Hey, Matt Damon. Well, guys, we completed this, got another prestige point. So now, basically, it's just a few things over here to go, and all of these ridiculous things to go. So we should probably get started on a few more of these next episode. Uh, that's really going to hurt. That's going to be a difficult thing to do. But um, I think we'll be all right. We'll, we'll, we'll get all these things done. But um, that is all the time we have left in this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button, and I'll see you guys on the next episode.